Hi there, this is Colleen from Keeping the Peace and welcome back for another episode of Colleen Answers Your Questions. Today it comes from Herrick USMC in the down bar of my two-year-old cleans her gun and that's a time when I was cleaning my gun and she was watching and she was wanting to copy everything I did on her toy gun. He says, hi, I have a two and a half year old boy at home and he's always staring at me while I clean my gun. I have a Winchester 1911 um, that's broken but looks almost identical to a real gun. Should I be letting my son clean that one that looks real or even identical to my own or should I stick with more like a toy gun? Okay, all I'm going to do is speak for my own experience because everyone has different feelings on this and I can tell you what we're going to do, okay, with our two-year-old. We have a two-year-old also. Until she's able to demonstrate that she can use proper safe gun handling with her toy guns, she will not be allowed to touch a real gun even if it's unloaded. So she has a toy revolver and she's being taught my gun safety song. If you haven't heard my gun safety song, then click here to watch that. She is learning the song. She understands what the different safety rules are, but she's definitely not consistent yet with her handling of her toy gun, so she's not yet allowed to touch a real one. Once she's able to demonstrate consistently that she can safely handle a toy gun in terms of muzzle direction, trigger finger, okay, then she will be allowed to touch a real yet unloaded gun. Once she demonstrates that she's safe with that, then it will be a real gun loaded with snap caps. Once she's safe with that, it would be a real gun with one round of ammunition, heavily you know, guarded by us, very close supervision. When she's able to handle that safely, then she would get two rounds and then three. So if you can imagine how that would work progressing. We would love to have her shooting a cricket rifle at four if it's possible. But it all depends on your specific child and how much they're able to use self-control, basically. So it's not just memorizing rules. It's having the self-control to employ them consistently. And that's my recommendation for every child. So the age might be different for each child. And if you have a young child and you have them shooting, let me know how you progressed your children in the comments down below uh, or if you have suggestions about that. This is what we've chosen, what we're going to do with our child, and I would love it if she could shoot at three. <laughs> but I'm watching her now, and I think it's probably going to be a little longer than that, uh, but we're going to keep at it, keep teaching her, keep demonstrating for her. She sees us carry every day, uh, both of us, and she's very familiar, but she's definitely not ready. So I hope I helped and answered your question. And I look forward to hearing what everyone has to say in the down bar. So God bless, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye.